Good evening and welcome to the channel, folks. We're going to do something a little different today. Today I'm going to be doing a gear review. Not something I usually do, but I get asked a lot about some of the equipment I use when I'm doing long exposure photography. And there's a new piece of equipment out that I use now. Uh, I didn't buy it because I needed something new. I didn't buy it because I wanted to upgrade. I bought it because I needed uh, an additional one to use when I'm out shooting uh, long exposures and time lapse all at the same time. Um, but this is something that I purchased myself. Uh, it's not sent to me by the manufacturer. This is not a paid review. This is me reviewing a piece of equipment that I've purchased for my own kit. Uh, and I thought I would share it with y'all. It has some updated features over the original version. So I wanted to share that with everyone uh, that might help you make a decision on buying your own holder for shooting long exposures if you're in the market to do that. The new leaf filter holder comes nicely packaged. It includes a nice microfiber pouch and all of the accessories that you need for shooting with one, two, or three filters. I like to use that carrying bag to put the filter holder and all of my filter rings in. The new filter holder picks up where the old design left off. Slim with almost no moving parts, but a nice finish. You can see it's not much bigger or different than the original holder. The thickness is roughly the same as it was before and the filter holder bars are about the same but I find them easier to change out when you want to switch from one, two or three holder slots. One of the biggest changes is the knob that you use to release the adapter rings from the filter holder. It is larger, it has a nice knurled texture on it but it also has a locking feature that keeps it from being bumped and uh, accidentally let go of the uh, adapter rings. The depth is pretty much the same as it was. I've always liked how slim this filter holder was. It doesn't take up a lot of space in my bag and it's also very lightweight. When using two filters at a time on an 18 millimeter lens, I don't see the filter in the image. It's not causing a vignette on the edges of my frame. I have also not experienced that when using a 16 millimeter lens. Because of the larger size of this filter holder, it just doesn't cause a vignette and show up in the corners of your image. One thing that has not changed is the round cutouts in the corners. Square filters will still overhang the edges and I highly recommend having foam gaskets on those filters to prevent light leak at the corners. Overall, I'm very happy with my purchase of this updated Lee filter holder. It is still lightweight, durable, and works with my existing filters. I would recommend it to anyone looking to add one to their bag. Thanks for watching. I hope you found this informative. Until next time, may the good light find you.